So Dan, you grew up in Wheaton. Dean and Rockford, you guys come to college here in Evanston. This whole football career has kind of been here by the lake. How much has being able to be here with your family and friends throughout this whole process, how much has that meant to you? Yeah, well, uh, it's home. Everyone lives here, so just being you know, in my hometown and in, in this area has been something special to me. And you know, I'm sure for Dean too, playing football here and being Chicago's you know Big Ten team, that's something that I've held you know dear to my heart my whole life. So it's pretty cool. To so be able to have that weekend uh, coming up here, it's just a really uh, um, exciting time for both of us and for our families and for Northwestern in general. So um, we're really excited about it. Just we got to keep keep working, you know. What can you guys take from what you learned from Coach Fitz or one of the other position coaches or anything from playing at Northwestern that while you're in this pre-draft process, you're getting ready for the NFL, you think to yourself, that's something I learned at Northwestern. You know, what, what are some of the things that you take from Big Ten football into the next level? You know, I would say two things. Coach Fitz is a uh, passion for the game. He's somebody that every day, every practice, every game, he really just is, is so into it and just loves the game. And it really just um, it rubs off on the team. You know, it's about um, you know, preparing right each day, each week, and really having that uh, consistent work ethic and attitude to uh, respond to adversity and also to uh, be humble and, and success. What's one piece of advice that's really stuck with you throughout this process, you know, leading up to the draft? You know, right now, just control what you can control. And it's really just, it's a process and enjoy it, but um, really just settle down, let things happen, and uh, be consistent in your work ethic and things will, good things will happen. It's just a very, very long process. Um, stressful at times, but at the same time, you gotta relax and just control what you can control. I think you kind of nailed that there. You know, this is something that we've been waiting for our whole lives, so uh, it's getting pretty close here. Have you thought at all about what that feeling, what that emotion is going to be like? Just getting that invite to be on an NFL team, have you thought about what that is going to mean to you when you think about everything you've worked for to this point? We're professionals now, so you can't really relish on it too much, enjoy it while the time lasts, and then um, get on to new things and, and earn your spot at the team. So that's what it's all about. All right, Dan, Dean, obviously people from Rockford to Wheaton to Evanston to Chicago all, all pulling for you guys. Uh, it's been a very interesting process for you in the pre-draft, and we wish you guys best, the best of luck moving forward as you go for those NFL dreams. Thanks. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Chicago is home to this year's NFL Draft, and WCIU The U is home to complete draft coverage. Join me, Hub Arkish, as our team breaks down this week's biggest picks live in Chicago Football Now's Draft Special, presented by American Family Insurance, Saturday at 7 p.m. on The U.